Okay, and now a lesson on how to fix symmetry. Oh yeah, I'm applying for sainthood early this year. Okay, so in here, let's load the demo head. Click and drag out and hit edit. Alright, so rundown on symmetry. Let's uh, pretend for example I don't want the eyes in here just for just for uh, educational purposes and let's turn on transform and activate symmetry off. Okay, so the basic rundown on symmetry and how it works. Well, if you draw on one side of the model like that and if I want it on the other side of the model all I do is have to go to the deformation palette and hit uh, Smart Resim X. This throws it on the other side of the model but at an average you see now that they are not the same. Control Z and this time I'm going to hold control and mask off the region and then Smart Resim. No average occurs. Okay, so that's easy. That's located underneath the Smart Resim and how that works. So let's look, move on to a little bit harder things. Let's uh, clear the mask. And in this case, let's do something that we always do. Let's go to the Move tool and transpose it over to this side. Draw. Okay, so now let's try that same trick. Let's uh, draw on one side. And let's smart resim it. Oh no, it says no symmetry found on those points. Why? Well, if you go to the Almighty Preview window, you'll find that you have moved the center point over. And you're probably going to go over here and say, well, I want to set that pivot point. Well, make sure you set it twice. Set it one more time. And now you'll find out that when you smart resim it, it works. Okay, another thing is while I'm here covering the preview window, uh, you'll find every once in a while that your items are really huge. Let's say I'm scaled way out here. The item looks small. If I go to scale, if I scale the item up, it scales it in the preview window, like to huge proportions. Let's hit draw. and what's going to happen is when I move around the item it's going to be a little bit slower for some reason okay because it's not at ZBrush standards another thing you notice is what happened to the pivot point well it moved so if I go to draw on this and I want it to appear on the other side when I hit Smart Resim it's not going to work because I have to go to transform and double click set pivot Smart Resim still doesn't work. Why? Well, that's easy. Let's go to Unify and hit F on the keyboard to bring it into focus. Go back to the Transform. Smart Resim. Works. Remember that when it's outside the preview range, um, when you've scaled it outside that region, a lot of things have a hard time doing. Like symmetry for one. Two, the move tool really does have a hard time moving points around when it's too big and it doesn't fit within the preview. Maps have a hard time generating if it's outside the preview. So that's it. That's all I have for you. That's how to fix symmetry and how it works and the almighty preview window.